Hello, hello, everybody. Welcome to the live. I am so excited. I have been amped up all day, all day. And people have called and have wished us well. And um, I was a little nervous for tonight. I don't know why, but I was. Um, in fact, I was so nervous that um, I poured the wrong drills back into the wrong container. Super fun. So I'll be spending this live separating out the two colors that I need to finish up Everest. Yes, I said it. Finish up Everest. Can you believe the slowest diamond painter on the planet had so much fun with Everest that I'm almost done. But that just means that I get to start Majesty. So I'm excited. I might get two paintings done by the end of the event. All right. Um, I want to start off before I tell everyone hello. I want to thank this committee. Um, I call them the dream team. Um, they are an amazing group of women that I'm very lucky uh to call friends. Um, they have had my back. They have worked their tails off. Um, and just what's cool about it is everyone in the group kind of has their own superpower. So where one person drops off, another person picks up for, I'm a big picture person. I'm the creative big picture. This is what I want but I have detail people and, and the detail people get together and what, what one person doesn't know, another person does. Um, again, I just cannot say enough. So um, Alyssa, Rochelle, Brandy, and Dakota. Dakota is a part of our committee. I, I know we're celebrating her and her art and she's the, she's the celebrity here, but um, she's also working. Um, I know you guys have noticed she's been answering questions in the group and just um, how very lucky we are to have an artist that not only um, supports us and supports this event, but actively participates and helps us. Um, I don't I don't know if any of you realize how really unheard of that is, but it, it really is. So um, I am so excited to celebrate Dakota and her work, um, not only because she's my favorite artist, she's all of our favorite artists, but um, but because of the person that she is. That's just her. And um, I'm just lucky to call her one of my dearest friends and I'm so blessed. So um, second of all, I wanna thank our sponsors. Um, we don't say thank you enough to our sponsors. I have done some sponsor spotlights on the Facebook page. I will continue to do um, some sponsor spotlights. I have posted things that I've gotten in the mail. However, there are sponsors and individuals that are not gonna send me stuff to send out, but they've got it. And uh, we wanna make sure that we spotlight them as well. So I will be doing that. But um, I have my Tumblr, Kokesha, along with my notebook. I was going to do a whole Dakotathon swag video, but I can't stand it. I had to use all this stuff. I have my notebook to write down any notes I might need tonight. Let's see what else do I have. I have my Firefly tray. Love me some Firefly. Hang on. Let me get the lid. Mm -hmm. Yes, using that. Using my Leopard Leatherworks Everest pen along with holding whatever I need in the trinket tray. In addition, I am marking my place with these beautiful, beautiful release papers from none other than Crafts with Crashly. Oh my gosh. Um, I could go on and on. And um, I am enhancing, of course, I don't even have to say it, right? I am enhancing Everest with DP with sparklers. All amazing, amazing um, folks. And I forgot to put something on my wrist. So when I... Um, let the committee come in from backstage. I'm going to go get it because uh, if Mama B is in the chat, I want to show off uh, my Dakotathon bracelet. You guys saw the uh, items that they have for Dakotathon that they're donating. So I just, I could go on and on and on BNC create. I mean, you know, I can't name them all because I don't want to leave anyone out, but thank you because we don't do what we do without our sponsors. And we are very, very blessed and very, very grateful 
um, to have all uh, to have all of them. So let me say hello to everybody. Woo! This is this this chat's going quick, going quick. So here we go, diamonds and dew. Why did I know Lee was going to be in here first? I knew it. Thank you, Lee. We can officially start the live. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, he's got Nutella today with white and dark and milk chocolate. All right. Cool. Hi, Laura Bishop. Hello, Marion. Welcome. Welcome. Wanda. Hi, Sarah. Hello. Sparkle, Dustin Diamonds. Hello. Crystal Leffler. Hello. Allison and Kim got a new groove. Hello. Oh, she's cooking and listening. All right. CM Luna. Hello. Robin Pennington and Melanie. Hi. Denise, hello. Linda, Pink Poodle, Ashley, hello, is in the house. Tina, hello. So Blingy. Oh, so Blingy is another sponsor. Oh my gosh. So cool. Um, let's see. Crystal Leffler, hello. The Diamond Painting Accountant is in the house and she's backstage. Sue Layden, hello. Carrie, welcome. Sarah, hello. I think I said hello to Sarah before, but hi, double hi, Sarah. Uh, Catherine, 197, hi. Jeannie, hello. I know I'm excited Dakotathon has started too. We've been waiting and waiting. Everybody was trying to start to post pictures and all kinds of stuff. Tia, hi. How are you, my friend? Good to see you. I'm so glad you're here. Canine Mama, aloha. Oh, wow, we're excited for your first. Uh, oh, you started Spirit. So it's Canine Mama's first Dakota thon. Crafting with Shay. Hello, Shay Shay. So glad you are here. Oh, my gosh. I'm very honored. We got some great people in here, all of you. Diamonds and Decaf and Dragon Wing Diamonds. Hello, Jessica. Hi. Heather Valentine is in the house. Heather is another sponsor. Oh my gosh. Just got a pen from Heather. This is not what she's donating, but she's donating two other beautiful diamond painting pens. So thank you, Heather. Oh my gosh. Let's see. The Diamond Help Desk. My friend Sophie's in the house. Yay. Lurking and cooking. Thank you. Thank you, Sophie. Love me some Sophie. She's one of my favorite people. Emma. Hello. CM Luna. Hello. Barb T. Hello, Barb. We are very excited. Barb is an individual. Um, I'm shouting her out. Um, she's donating gift baskets and we're working on prizes for kids with Barb. So, Love you, Barb, so much. Thank you so much for everything that you're doing for this event. Um, Diamonds and Dogs, hello. Samantha and Lisa, hello. Glad you're working and lurking. Zodiac Shadows, did you guys see the picture I posted from Zodiac Shadows? They are donating some drill grinders. I posted their link. They are a sponsor. I just got one, so when I get it, I will definitely be uh, showing that on the page. Thank you, Zodiac Shadows, for, for your donation and for having such cool stuff in your shop. Uh, Christina, hello. Brandy, Styles, hello. Tribe of Travis, hello. Let's see. Linda is working on Leo. Hello. Risa, hi. Welcome. Uh, Tommy and Ann and Jess. Debbie Rice is in the house. Hello. Oh my gosh, I can barely keep up. Uh, Catherine started Everest today. Catherine, you're going to love it. Like I said, I have sped through this painting because I've enjoyed it so much. No one. I think it's one of Dakota's favorites. So <laughs> um, let's see. Jennifer. Hello, Kim. Hi, Wanda. I bet you are not slower than I am. <laughs> well, you know, we, we could have a slow race. Uh, <laughs> Leanne. Hello. Oh, she started Hazel today. Oh, gosh. I know there's so many that I, I switched and switched and switched until right before the event started. Uh, Tina, oh my God, did that Saturday with two color. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're still mixed up in my tray, but I'm so excited. I don't even care. I'll figure it out. Hi, Cheryl. Cheryl with DP with Sparklers, another event sponsor. -er. Hello, hello. Um, let's see. Carrie and Wanda and Sarah. Veronica, Sapphires and Ocean Waves is in the house. Hello, how are you? Kim got a new groove. Chaotic. Hi. Welcome. Crystal. Hello. Uh, yes. Yes. Um, she was so happy when she commented on your Facebook post. I, I think you're maybe talking about uh, Dakota. Dakota does rock. 
I know. That's why we're all here, right? Um, oh my gosh, you guys. I don't want to miss anybody. There's Dakota. Dakota is backstage. I'm seeing her. So uh Krista Leopard Leatherworks is in the house. I just showed off their pen. Tim and Carrie are here. Bling it up. Uh, let's see. Anita, hello. Oh my gosh. Jenny, hello, Lillian. Welcome. And yes, we do love Dakota and the sponsors. Uh, the Lauren. 1113. Hello. Yay. It's your first DP event. You picked the best one. How did you know? That is awesome. Uh, Della. Hello. Sue Bell is in the house. Elizabeth. Hello. Happy little drill. CM Luna. Hello. Let's see. Ah, Naomi. Hello. Hello. Hello to you too. Um, everyone's saying hello. First Dakota Thon. Christine, welcome. So glad you're here. Uh, Jay Lee, hello. Let's see. Um, Shell Anderson, Victoria, hello. Another first time Dakota Thoner. Oh my gosh, we've got a lot of first timers. Welcome again. How did you guys know you picked the best event? Um, Allison, okay, this chat is just flying. Butterfly kisses, Kokisha, hello. Did you see? Did you see? I got it. I got it, girl. Allison is working on Glass Mermaid. Um, let's see. Samantha working on Wave Mermaid. Wanda, don't multi-place anymore. Easier and less hassle. Yep. Catherine Brown is in the house. Hi, Kat. Welcome, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. Um, let's see. Diamond Days. Hello. Oh, my gosh. Uh Julie, welcome to your first uh, Dakotathon. I'm so glad you're here. Yes, Kim, happy Dakotathon. Uh, Diamonds and Doxies, first time too. Awesome. Tijuana Crafter, hello. Uh, Diamonds and, uh, and Doxies. Okay, I, just, I thought it was Diamonds and Daisies. It's Diamonds and Doxies. Uh, jo uh, Jonna, hello. Okay. Joe, hello, welcome. Okay, I think I'm caught up. If I did not say hello, I am terribly sorry, but this chat is flying. Let me, without any further ado, bring in the dream team. First of all, she is bling it up. She is beautiful inside and out. I remember the first time I saw Rochelle and I'm like, does she even realize how gorgeous she is? Anyhow, and she is as smart as she is gorgeous and such um, such a, a quality individual. And I'm so proud to, to get to work with her and get to know her better. So come on in, Rochelle. Bling it up. Hello. Hello, everyone. How are you? Hi. Now, I have to say, come on, Kara. You got to give yourself some credit, too. You are a major, major in this event. Best host ever. So everybody, I just want to give Kara some kudos. She's done a fabulous job with this. Of course, Dakota, because Dakota art is just amazing. Alyssa and Brandy, but Kara, thank you. Thank you for all the time and effort you put into this. And thank you for bringing me on. I'm super excited. Glad to Yay. be here. And I'm looking to have some fun. So I'm hoping everybody out there is ready to show your paintings. Absolutely. Hopefully you got your Dakota wear. Mm -hmm. And you, you got your Dakota wear. Come on now. Let's take some yes. pictures and let's have some fun. So glad to be here. And again, Dakota, for me, she's one of my favorite artists. I got one of her paintings sitting on top of the bling table right now in the bling lab. And I got another one waiting to be kitted up. So I'm super excited to be part of this. So thank Yay! you for having me. Yeah. Yeah. Well, um, again, I call them the dream team. And I've told them they can never leave. They can never <laughs> resign. They can never leave. We're in this for life. So... <laughs> Uh, hopefully I can keep them around. I won't drive them too crazy. All right. Um, I want to bring in next Alyssa. I have gotten to work with Alyssa on several things. And again, Alyssa is a beautiful person inside and out. And um, she is our technology guru. She just, um, again, I, I love talking with her. She has become a dear, dear friend of mine. Um, she keeps us all straight. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. Cause I do need that in my life. Cause I'm, you know, like I said, I'm a big picture person and she helps me out a lot with the details and um, I need a Google form. She's like, okay, I'll, I'll do it. <laughs> um, and again, we love her and we are so blessed that she's a part of this group. So welcome, welcome the diamond painting accountant. 
Hi. 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 So I keep getting kicked out. Um, I think it's an internet issue on my end. We have some really bad storms moving through. So okay, well, out, I'll log back in from my phone. But I'm so excited to be here. Um, anybody that has heard me talk knows that Dakota is one of my favorite artists, like probably my number one favorite artist. And I'm so excited to get to um, collaborate with y'all and work together on this. Yay! Okay, before I bring in the woman of the hour, I just need to tell everybody, if y'all can throw some hearts up, um, Brandy is not with us tonight. Her husband is in the hospital. He's doing better. I talked to her before the live. Um, he's having some kidney stuff going on, but they have um, <clears throat> figured that out and um, he is improving. And um, just put some hearts up for Brandy. We love her. Um, she's another... Um, integral part of our team and she will be back uh next week uh for sure and um love you bestie she is my bestie and um i just uh can't say enough about her and the work that she's put in also okay are we ready are we ready the reason really why everyone's here right because that's why we're all here too so here she is, the woman of the hour. Um, we love her art. Uh, that's why there's so many people here and so many people interested in this event. We are very, very blessed to have her not only as our featured artist who we love, but also a part of the committee. Um, she's one of the most humble people I know. She still doesn't understand why all this fuss is being made, but hopefully she'll get it eventually. I don't know though. <laughs> But here she is, the woman of the hour, Dakota. Hi. Hello. Oh, I like your hair. You look good, sister. Thanks. Put some brown in it. I like it. <gasps> what is behind you? Oh, my I goodness. This one this week, it's an oil painting of a lynx for my friend Denise. She just bought it as I started this live. She just put a deposit on it, so it's hers. So. Oh my it's gosh! Gorgeous. It's gorgeous. gorgeous. Oh, I love it's so pretty. See, this is the thing, right? What is Whenever that? Dakota comes out with a new painting, you already know. We're just counting down the days to day he gets it. Just counting down. <laughs> I, I hope they get this one. I hope they pick it up. That it's is beautiful. Beautiful. Oh my gosh! And I just, again, I always marvel at how realistic everything looks in your painting. <laughs> It's, you know, it's like it can just jump out at you. So, oh, there's Denise. I'm beyond happy. <laughs> Gorgeous. Yay. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Well, I know that you heard, Dakota. I was so excited and nervous and just anticipating. And, okay, y'all want to know what nerdy thing I did before the live? Y'all want a good laugh? I literally turned on. Now, y'all may be a little young for this group because they were not a, like a big group in the 80s, but you've seen them on commercials. I literally turned on Europe, the final countdown, the song. Yeah. I was playing it right before the live. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm your nerd. There you go. That's I'm your, your big hype nerd. music. You gotta have that hype music, right? I have hype music. Yes. You gotta have <laughs> so that hype music. I was literally playing the final countdown, but was, was so excited that I put two, you can, I don't want to dump them out on my computer, but you can see the two different colors that I dumped in the wrong <laughs> container. So I told everyone I will be spending this live, not diamond painting, but separating the colors out. So hopefully <laughs> I'll be straight by the time it's over and, and everything else. So, all right, guys. So we are all here. Let's see. Yes. Okay. So Alyssa is our link goddess. Thank goodness. Um, you can get, um, someone asked earlier and I saw and Dakota answered the question, but in case anyone else had the question, they said, when is Dakota going to stop having the shirts? And she's like, I I'm not, you can get them anytime. Um, and I think that is the case for all of our sponsors. If you want to jump in, if you decide you want a firefly tray. Now they did want me to firefly did want me to mention to you, if you get a tray, these are custom trays, so you'll have to, you know, wait a little bit when you order them. But um, I love them; they're a great, they're the perfect size for this for Everest, you know, painting a bigger painting, um, which most of Dakotas are. 
Um, but you're going to wait a little bit, but you can still order them. You can still order your Everest pens, trinket trays. You can still order your release papers from Crashly, any of those things. So um, uh, I'm excited. Uh, but, you know, again, if you needed to, if you need, let's be real. If you need to wait till payday or you need to wait until tax returns come in, what have you, we all get it. We've all been there. Um, they will, the items will still be there. So, um, no worries on that. We're not going to have a deadline where we say, Oh, you can't buy it anymore. So, um, you know, that is, which is good since, <laughs> since my bank says no at this time. Yeah. Yeah. And my, my children used to call my debit card, the magic card. And <laughs> they would be in the back seat. I'd be driving them home from school and they'd go, Hey mom. How magical is the card today? <laughs> and I would either say, oh, it's very magic. What do you need? Or there is no magic to be had today. It is not magic at all. So yeah, they, they kind of knew about the magic card uh, and when it was magical and when it was not. So, um, oh good, Dakota tumblers are sitting and waiting for immediate mailing. Cool, all right, awesome. Uh, so yes, if, you're, if your magic card like mine may not be so magical, don't worry, you can still you'll still be able to buy throughout the event. Also, someone asked earlier if they could, um, they hadn't gotten their uh, Dakota painting yet. Could they jump in? Yes, you are able to jump in. Um, just put your start, like if you, if you jump in at week two, if you're not participating this week, just jump in at week two and put your picture on week two. Um, for prizes. So yes, you can jump in. So if anyone was wondering that, um, you certainly can. We want everyone, you know, to feel welcome here and, and all of that. So yeah, enough somebody, of my hammering. Somebody has feedback in their mic. It's kind of hard to hear. Oh. I wonder if that's my keyboard. Uh, it's like a hum. Probably my There we go. Oh, that fixed it. Yep. Can we hear Alyssa still? No. Oh. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> it's, it's probably my keyboard causing that. So I'll just mute my mic if I start typing. Okay. Oh, that's good. Cheryl uh, Gearhards had a great suggestion for someone waiting for their painting. You could do a coloring page. And for those of you that, again, um, there are Dakota last year nicely put up free coloring pages. Yes, I have my coloring books. Yes. <laughs> Um, if you're waiting on a coloring book to come in or what have you and want just want to participate this week, uh, Dakota did put a few free coloring pages up last year and we kept them up. So um, if you want to use those, you're more than welcome while you're waiting for your coloring book to come in. So, yeah, uh, my kids should be here by the third. Yay. OK, I'm telling you, I'm waiting on that. Um, the spa picture. I want that as a diamond painting so bad. The manatee spa. Oh, can you hear me, Dakota? Yeah, I can hear you now. Yep. Okay. Okay, cool. I'm just reading oh. the chat. Oh, okay. So enough of my yammering. What have you been up to, Dakota? What What's going on in your world? I've been doing a different kind of painting this week. I painted my house. <laughs> oh. A couple, of, a couple of rooms that needed it really bad. So I'm beat. I'm so tired. Man, painting walls is hard, <laughs> really hard. <laughs> Coming from a painter, that sounds funny. But yeah, <laughs> I know, up, it is. It's up on a ladder and like reaching over your head for hours. I'm like, oh, so tired. <laughs> I'm not in this good a shape. <laughs> yes, yeah, well, I can't, yeah, I can't even, I can't even imagine. I was, um, we went to my storage unit to pull some diamond paintings for a stash video and the next day I was like, I'm sore. I'm like, this is so sad. I'm sore. Yeah. Really? And all the yeah. trim. Oh, Allison has been painting ceilings. Oh, that's oh. gotta be worse. Yeah. Oh. Uh, so hoping that the landscape ones in voting recently and a couple of times before are in the top and coming soon. Yes, yes, absolutely. Um, Emily, I need the manatee. <laughs> I need that one. <laughs> I love it. Yes, I want that one so bad. Oh, yeah, lightning storms. Okay, here's Rochelle again. Let me get her. There you go. Yes, we have some storms in that area, so sorry about that, guys, but I'm back. I'm back. Yes. How's your weather, Alyssa? Is it still looking well, like it's... Well, looks green. 
Uh oh. Three. Wow. <laughs> We're so supposed to get between 12 and 18 inches of snow in the next few days here. So, and massive yeah. power outages. So, this was good timing. Oh, wow. Oh you, can, you can keep that up there. Yeah. <laughs> I don't that here. No, there's nuts. I'm fine with snow. I don't like hurricanes. I don't like fires. And I don't like earthquakes. I'll take the snow. I'm good. Okay. <laughs> Texas we are one thing because I don't know about everybody else, but my favorite color is blue. Even this room that I'm in right it's painted blue right so everything about dakota that's blue is me <laughs> like give me all the blue so so blingy was the first right so so blingy made me a ton of like blue light pad cover right i'm like yes so wait a minute i got candy delicious pens and i know heather's in so i'm like heather i don't know which painting i'm going to do right now i'm doing libra so she was able to come up with something that matches any dakota painting right it's just the perfect colors as well as she did something that matched Snow Tiger, which is the next one I'm going to do. Firefly, of course. Come on now. You know, the blue is all over. So, Dakota, keep on with the blue. Anything blue. <laughs> I don't plan on stopping. Here. I think Dakota likes blue, too. <laughs> I do. My I like favorite water. color. Yeah, water is like a big theme in all my art. So, blue is going to be in there forever. All right. Love Hang it. on, guys. I'm going to run get something um, from Mama B because I want to show um, what she's doing for this. She is a sponsor. Um, let me go get it. Y'all talk amongst yourselves. I'll be right back. Yes. Okay. Yes. And I also want to mention, um, April Harris for Putty Crocker. And I have a bunch of her putty and I was looking for a blue one, but she has this, she's I'm a tester for this putty gold right now. And it's just amazing. So as I'm doing, of course, I'm blinging out Libra because that's what I do. Hence mm -hmm. the name, bling it up. And not a single AB, not a single metallic can pull a putty out. So, um, and I do have something that's like a blue and white from her. So I'm like, I gotta find it because everything has to match. I just absolutely love, love blue. And Alyssa, I'm sure you do too. I know you do. I know you do. Right? You love it? How about everybody in the audience? Do you guys love blue? I hope they do if they're here. <laughs> like my art. There yeah. It is. How do you get those effects? Those are so cool. <laughs> so it's, first of all, it's on iPhone. If you have oh. an iPhone. Okay. If you're in studio on the iPhone, there's certain ones. So I'll play, I've been playing around with it for a little bit. You have, I think this is lasers. You'll see lasers come out, dark oh, later. Cool. Right? You have hearts. Love and it. You have firecrackers. I love it. And it's a couple other ones. I gotta I gotta play around. There's a couple oh, other fun. ones. You can do. This is rain. <laughs> this is my neighborhood. This is a storm. So <laughs> thumbs down is like a cloud of rain. I it's so much it. fun. So much fun. No, it's super cute. So leave oh, it to me for the fun stuff, guys. Leave it to yeah. me. I will always find ways <laughs> to have fun. If you guys haven't seen her Libra that she's doing, it is incredible. The stuff that you're adding to it is, I'm, I sit there and like s s zoom in on it and I'm like, oh my Aww. God, it's so cool. I love it. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. And wait till you see it. I, I, I'm going to reveal it probably in the Facebook. So if you guys aren't, you know, have enjoyed Dakota Facebook group, please join it. Uh, you will see. I'm going to do probably tonight. I'm going to put some pictures up of Libra. Yeah, cool. absolutely. Well, and it's funny because I have started now on Everest. Um, I added just one extra thing besides what was recommended by DP with sparklers. But I have started in paintings doing my own thing. Um, but. Rochelle takes it to a completely other level. Like it is, it is so awesome. Just her, her talent for that. Fun. I just am like, oh my gosh. Okay. Let me show y'all because um, this is not the same color. If you go back to, again, we keep referring everybody to the Dakota Thon page. If you have not joined the page, join it. I am posting pictures. Oh, well, everybody's posting pictures of sponsor uh, donations of what is going on. We have a whole list uh, in the featured section of sponsors. Um, I had to look this up the other day because I thought, okay, I'm going to finish Everest. I'm going to go to Majesty, but I need my bling for Majesty. And I thought, what is the DP with Sparklers uh, discount code? I went to the page went to it. The, the discount codes are all there as well. So you can refer to all of that. Plus, Alyssa has done an amazing job with putting live links 
to all of the businesses. So you just click on the link and it takes you right to the business that you want to go to. So um, we're trying to make it easy and leave things in one place. So go to featured if you can't find something in nine chances out of 10, it will be there. But Mama B Diamond Drilling, is she in the house? She normally is, but this is my bracelet. It's green. It's like jade. It's so pretty. She and her daughter, Brittany, have started a business. You'll notice, uh, can you can you guys read the charm? It says Dakota Thon 24. Here, let me take it off so I can show you guys. That's oh, it's cute. I love it. It says Dakota Thon 24, and she's got, okay, I'm so terrible. There we go. Dakota Thon 24. And um, her business is called Bees Gems Crafted. And she does, not only does she do these beautiful bracelets, and she has donated, um, the ones that she donated for giveaways are purple. There is a picture of them in the on the Dakota Thon page. Now, joining the Dakota Thon page, you must. You must, 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 must answer the three questions and hit submit. I think some people answer the questions and they forget to hit submit and you're going to get declined. That's the only reason why we're declining people. So make sure that you tell people, answer the three questions. Some people answer two, not one, not two, but three questions. That's it. And they're very simple to answer and um, hit submit and it's you're fine so um just everyone remember that but anyway she and her daughter are designing these bracelets and i mean they've got lapis rose quartz they've got you know the green it almost looks like jade it may be i'm not sure but um anyhow uh she her business is in there too um, but she also does the precious stone cover minders that are adorable she's got little penguins on stones um, I think she's found crabs. She has found penguins. She's found all, all Dakota-ish things. I'm making up words now. <laughs> I told someone earlier they Googleified something. Someone said, can you send me that? And I'm like, I don't know. They've Googleified it. So I'm not sure. If I can. And they're laughing at me. But anyway, so thank you, Mama B. I didn't, I just wanted to give her a shout out. So I don't know if she's in here or not, but, um, Chris says, I'm so glad you're feeling better, Dakota. I understand living with chronic pain. That's me every day. So, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, hello, Rosanna. Welcome. Welcome. So, uh, yeah. Uh, here, I used to live in uh, Kittery. Is that Kittery, Maine, many moons ago? I don't know where Kittery is. I just know that LL Bean is in Maine and that's my son's, one of my son's favorite store. Every time, every Christmas, he's like, mom, can you order me LL Bean? I'm like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's a good store. Yes. He loves it. Good store. So, so what's everyone working on? Very white can curl up in the chat. Like, yeah. What the code of painting are you working on? Yes. And um, while they're doing that, Rochelle, do you want to talk to them about the, um, the threads that you put up today and yes, what, yes, what's going absolutely. on. So you guys, if you see me mad rushing in the morning, trying to put up some info before I left for work and then putting up info at work was a lot of fun. So you'll see three threads out. Actually, you'll see six. So the first three are actually for your, your start or your kid up. But some people have a painting that may, they may have started already. You have to have at least a, is it 50 by 40 or 30 by 40 pair. So 30, 30 by 40. 40. 30 by 40. So you'll see three threads. One is for kids. One is for diamond painting. And the last one is for coloring, cross stitch, and painting. That's for your start picture. Then you'll see another three that I put up probably two hours after the start. Same three categories, but it'll say work in progress week one. So you'll have a week one for your kids category a week one for your diamond painting category and a week one for your coloring cross stitch and painting the key is you have to make sure you have a startup picture in the start okay closer closure for the whip is the 6 at 10 p.m cst or cdc same thing central daylight time or central standard time 
So that is 10 p.m. on April 6th. So take note of that. But make sure you have something in the startup and then you post one time this week in your whip. Just once. Don't confuse me. Just Please, once. only once. <laughs> and um, someone was talking to me today and I, I want to avoid confusion. So let me explain. So we are taking turns being in charge of posting the threads and all of that just so we share the love and you know no one's overwhelmed with um work because so many of you are participating which is a great problem to have um but you'll notice the posts for you to post your progress for the week goes up on monday and closes every monday the post will go up in the morning and close at 10 o'clock central standard time on saturdays you will notice that on the Sundays during this event, nothing is posted. You can't post or anything. Sunday is our admin work day. That's the day that we all are going to meet as a committee to draw winners for the live um, uh, for the following week. And I want everyone to know, just in case there are any questions, all of us are meeting together. All of us are participating in the drawing. So one of us isn't drawn our friends or whatever everyone is involved so that there are five sets of eyes on the drawing and you know the random number generator and who is picked the reason i'm not drawing live is because i hate it and i hate it because when you are live there is absolutely no room for error and if you draw a name and the person has not done what they needed to do to qualify and you announce their name, it's kind of late. And then everyone's like, well, wait a minute. You know, they go back and people look, don't think they don't, they do. People go back and look and then I get, well, they didn't do what they needed to do. And you know, they shouldn't have been picked. And that's why I don't draw live. It just leaves a lot of room for error. This way, all five of us can be in on the drawings, who qualified, if there's any question, we have five brains in the room where we can say, okay, you know, let's go with this or that or the other. And again, um, there's five of us. So we all kind of have to be in agreement. There's no, you know, um, there's never going to be a tie. So that's how, that's why we're doing the things that we're doing. Um, just trying to be transparent here. But so Sunday, you're not posting anything on Sunday. It's kind of, it's a work day for you too. So just keep going on your Dakotas on Sunday and uh, don't worry about having to post anything or a deadline or whatever. Sundays are, Sundays are rest day. So um, that's the reason why there's a skip in for Sundays on posting and posting closing. I hope that makes sense. Um, all great choices, yes. <laughs> So many people. Um, what was funny is I um, I've pulled all. This, so the reason why I'm sore is because I pulled all these paintings. Yes, I'm late for my March um, stash video. I will have it up, but I'm looking at. Of course, you know I'm like. Of course, I have all the Dakota mermaids. So I'm looking at wave mermaid, and I'm looking at glass mermaid, and I'm like, I just. Uh, well, I have dreaming of being human, but it's no longer in my stash because I'm finished with it. So uh, it was fun to look at those and um a lot of these paintings um i haven't even pulled out of the box with the plastic off yet so it was really fun to open those up and see them in person so yeah so okay. i figured i'll do the year of dakota i have enough painting maybe the two years of dakota i'll just do <laughs> the paintings and i'll still have more so i'm thinking about that for 2025 2026 so We'll see how that goes. I um I think uh, I think there'll be more coming too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> be more. So it may be a five year plan with us. <laughs> I don't know. Because and I got brave, guys. I got brave. I went and got Majesty for cross stitch, and it's kitted up. So I'll be starting right. Majesty as well Ooh, for cross stitch. I want to see that. <laughs> oh my gosh! I remember and you saying you were cross stitch before, right? So yeah, we had a question come up a couple of times in the chat. They want to know what happens if they finish their painting early. Start Good another question. one. Or what you can do again, um, post, you know, post your finish. And um, if you do not want to start and like if you finish a week early, you're, there's no way that you're going to open up a Dakota diamond painting and be able to finish it or what have you. 
just repost your finish and that'll be that. So um, you can start another one. Um, but if you could, if you do start a second um, diamond painting for our record keeping, so we don't have to, you know, cross reference a bunch of stuff. If you could, when you post your next painting, please put in the comp or the, you know, the cat, the writing in your post that it's your second Dakota, just so that we know, okay, this is their second one that will help us. If we draw you as a winner, no, okay, this is their second one. They have finished a first one. It's just helpful. If you let us know that we appreciate it. Yep. Where did we find Dakota cross stitch? We would love to get one. Chartingcreations.com, and then just search for my name. And I hear Alyssa's fingers flying over the keyboards <laughs> to post a link to Charting Creations. Charting Creations um, is the cross-stitch company that legally licenses um, Dakota's work. That is another very, very important thing. You guys know um, whenever I unbox something, I talk about legally licensed art. Um, again, just... If you're working, Dakota is legally licensed exclusively with Diamond Art Club. That's where you get your paintings. Now, she was licensed with Craftably. We will take a Craftably because she was licensed with Craftably. By the way, I found my sunflower from Craftably. I was shocked. I thought I lost it and I was losing my mind and um, I found it the other night. Yeah. You Good. lost it in your stash. I'm sure yes. you lost it in your stash. I'm sure none of you have done that. Oh, lost yes. the painting in your stash. Oh yeah, I've done no, it. No one does that. I know I had it. I can't find it. My favorite was when I was literally on the floor of my bedroom because my stash has now I'm an amoeba and so it's got little tentacles everywhere in our house and we have a storage and all that. I spent a half an hour crawling around on the floor because I was sure Everest was under our bed because under <laughs> our bed is, is yeah, it's, 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 it's a trip. But um, no, couldn't find it, pulled everything out, put it all back, walked into my craft room. Everest is leaning up against the wall, staring me in the face. And I'm like, really? See? Really? <laughs> Gotta love it. Gotta oh love my it. gosh. That's funny. Uh, oh, never. Emily says never. She's never lost a painting in her stash. Oh my gosh. I need your organization, Emily. <laughs> Eligible. Yes. Yes. Uh, you do need to, fi you don't need to finish. Um, that's another great question. Um, <clears throat> a lot of Dakota's paintings, as we know, are very large. That's why this is a two month event. Um, you do not need to finish. All you need to do, um, and I've seen, um, this is a great idea. Um, people have measured out on their canvases a 30 by 40 area. Just take a tape measure and measure out. We are not going to, there's no measurement police. This is kind of the honor system. We can estimate what's 30 by 40. Some people have several sections of their canvas and they're like, well, this count. We can we can estimate we're, we're, we're not going to be that strict on it. But just again, in fairness to everyone and in, in the spirit of the event, just make sure that it's a 30 by 40 uh, area. Some people before they start will section off an area um, to show that it's a 30 by 40. You can do that. Um, but we should be able to look at your canvas and, and see that, you know, you've got a 30 by 40 area. Like I said, there are no measurement police. Um, and um, we are certainly not going to take the time to pull out Dakota paintings. And no, it, you're, <laughs> it's the honor system. So um, and I want to mention too, because I've had people ask this, it's 30 by 40 centimeters, right? It's yeah. not inches. Yes. Yeah. So it, I think it's like 12 by 18 or so inches ish. Yeah. 12 so by 16. 12 by 16. Yeah. Yeah. What another thing that we are going to be looking for and Again, this is to respect our sponsors, to respect the committee and the work that they've done, to respect Dakota, to respect the event and everyone participating in it. We ask that when you post your progress pictures that you have made progress. Laying five drills down is not making progress. You need, I mean, we're not gonna be sticklers, but I mean, we need to see that you've, you're moving along on your paintings. 
Okay. So um, just know that we're, we are going to be looking at, at progress. And if there's a question we may get with you or what have you, but just make sure that you're making progress. Um, because again, the prizes that we have to uh, give people are amazing. Um, and, you know, we're eating the cost of shipping and all that kind of thing. So um, just make sure you're making progress. We want, you know, we want you to participate and be a part. So 12. Okay. Barb. Thank you, Barb. 12 inches by 18 inches. Perfect. Awesome. It's 16. Okay. I'm sorry. It's 16 inches. Either way. It's fine. It's just approximate. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Again, there are no measurement police. Yeah. <laughs> uh, went through all my hiding spots to find a painting. It was out in the open in my family room. <laughs> I already put it aside. Yeah, I know. That, that I can't find things when I put them where they're supposed to be. That's my trick too. It's like, oh, it was where it was supposed to be. No wonder I couldn't find it. Oh, that's <laughs> me. Life. And I like staying organized, but when I do that clean, it's like, why did I do that? Now I can't find it. Can't find it. And Emily Hansen mentioned for the cross stitch for Majesty, it's a lot of blues. It is blues and purples. And it took me probably about, I'll stretch over there and get it. It took me about two hours to kit it up. And I decided just to kit it in the floss bags so I can keep moving quickly. It was about an hour and 45 minutes, but it's all kitted and it's ready to go. So uh, a lot of blues, blues and purples, but again, those are my colors. So. Well, y'all were talking about, y'all were talking about blue and I was thinking, you know, I opened two elementary schools and when you open schools, you get to pick everything. You get to pick the mascot. Y'all are going to laugh. <laughs> was Kilpatrick Elementary. Okay. You can look it up. It's in Katie. I opened the school. The namesake, this, this was a cultural mismatch and we confuse children beyond all. I mean, okay. So Odessa Kilpatrick was the namesake. She was the first African-American administrator Katie had ever seen. She was loved, beloved administrator. This beautiful new school is named after her. It was Kilpatrick. So we let the kids vote and the mascot was the koala. So hang on. We have an African-American namesake, Australian themed school with a koala as the mascot. My, my two assistant principals were Olga Leonard. Olga Leonard was Hispanic and Malin Rodriguez. Malin Rodriguez was white. So inclusion at its best, Kara. Olga, Mrs. Rodriguez, Malin, Mrs. Leonard. I mean, yeah, I'm like, way to confuse the kids. I'm like, really? Okay. <laughs> love it. I love but it. But both schools, so I opened Kilpatrick and I opened Holland, and the colors for Kilpatrick were cobalt blue and uh, green. Then I opened Holland, and we were the Holland Huskies. So it was a tundra kind of theme. And our colors were cobalt blue, silver, and white. So blue, you know, love it. I got to pick the colors, so blue love is it. it. <laughs> oh, Bert is saying I missed her address for the sunflowers. I already sent the other one to Debbie Rice last <laughs> year. Debbie won the other sunflower. <laughs> I'm hoping well, Diamond Art Club will release that one in the Angel of Justice sometimes. I want Angel of Justice. I think so Berta. Bad. I Berta so want April Berta, Berta got eaten in an auction. I happened to see it and I was like, oh, I know Berta. I got to call Berta. Berta. <laughs> Hi, Berta. I got so lucky and I got eaten for a trade for a couple of journals. I oh, went eaten so bad. Like a year ago. Oh, oh my gosh. I managed well, to get you still have it, Berta. I'm going to look you up. Well, I got Eden. Um, I lucked out, um, raining diamonds. She's raining diamonds on YouTube. Nicest, nicest lady. And I, I got Eden and she sent her and I, and I did it. And, um, she's still at my dad's still at my dad's. <laughs> my stepmom um, just wants to hold on for a little while longer and I can't be mean. So, and everyone's enjoying it. So I'm like, okay, okay. I will just keep going. I'll just come visit it. I'll just come visit. It's okay. And, uh, but, and then Angel oh of Justice. God. Berta I, has two. Berta has two Edens? 
Berta, I need one. What? She said, Berta. Oh my gosh. Berta is going to start a feeding frenzy on this live. Yeah. <laughs> call my me. Berta, message call me. me girl. Girl. I'll, I'll trade you for a painting. <laughs> I'm just joking. And I have I have Angel of Justice from Craftably, but I would like to have Angel of Justice if DAC really they need to release it. It's such a beautiful painting. Oh my gosh. So love, uh, Cheryl, you know what? I recently managed to get my hands on Eden and I'm so happy about it. I've been looking for forever. Good. I need it. I want to talk to Berta after this. Mm -hmm. I think, okay, y'all, I'm just going to tell on Berta. I think Berta has stuff that we don't know about, that we need to know about, Berta. What what else do you have? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh. Berta's going to have, like, 50 messages in 10 minutes. <laughs> I know. Yeah, Berta, sorry. Your, your phone's going to blow up, girl. Love you, Berta. <laughs> Sitting on Eden. The only reason I haven't sold her is in case I get enhancements for her, but I can't find the regular drills. Oh, okay. Well, mm. I have sent enhancements. The enhancements that I did for Eden, I've sent them to a bunch of people. So if you want my list, then I can send it to you. I've sent it. I've sent my enhancements that I did for Eden to a bunch of people. Uh, looking for the rose from Craftably. Yeah. Oh, she doesn't have the sunflowers. Okay. Eden is my unicorn. Yeah, Eden is a lot of people's <laughs> unicorn. A lot of people's unicorn. Every time every time there's a post in, in Diamond Art Club for what's your unicorn? Eden, Eden, Eden. <laughs> and like the it. only response that people get it, does anyone have it? And people are like, yeah, good luck. I want it too. <laughs> I hope they'll bring it back you. eventually. If enough it's people beautiful. Ask. I need to I gotta get my hands on it. I gotta talk to Anita too. Anita doesn't yeah. have drills. Don't worry, I don't need drills. I do my own design. So it would be worth we'll it to it. yeah, it would be worth it to just get the drills. <laughs> Man, I would love to see what you did with that one, Rochelle. Oh, oh I gotta get my hands on Eden. Yeah. I would I, I'm hoping. I'm gonna cross my fingers. I got Berta, I got Anita. Yeah. Anybody else has it? Just um, just let me know. We can, you know, we can talk. We can work a deal. We can work. Yeah, we can work it out. Yeah, I need well, to see that. So. Well, and what's interesting is I've always said Diamond Art Club um, should bring back some of the ones that um, they put out because I mean, I don't know how I missed Eden to begin with. Even though at the time it came out, it must. When did it come out, Dakota? Do you know when they put it out? I think it's just about two years ago. Was the very first painting they did of mine. And yeah. it like kind of, it, it sold out quickly. And then I don't know if they did a restock or not, but it kind of- It was March 2022. <laughs> they came out in 2022 and it was limited edition. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I was working. I missed it. Well, I saw it, you know, after of course it was out and I was like, how did I miss this? Like, where was I? Wow. I said the same thing, Kara. I have no idea. And I'm so <laughs> mad that I missed it. Yeah. It's like I Majesty, but I got Majesty on the restock. I was like, yes. Now I, just, I gotta find Eden. Yeah. I well, get three or four of them for giveaways, and I didn't grab an Eden either. So. <sighs> well, I almost, um, I almost missed Glass Mermaid when it came out because uh, my aunt it was. It was so interesting because my aunt would have. I know she's on a pink cloud laughing about this, but um, we were on our way to my aunt's funeral. My aunt had just passed away, and my aunt and my mom were like crafty. And crafters are a little competitive. They, 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 mm -hmm, my, I, I know this and I know this and whatever. And so whenever she and my mom would get together, it was, well, I did this. Well, I did this. And it was just so funny to watch them. And I, at that point, I didn't care. So I was like, you're ridiculous. Okay, whatever. Um, but I had, I was talking to my cousin. It was before the funeral. We were driving. And I totally missed the early release. And it was gone in like, five minutes so i was like it's gone it's gone and so i kept still in the car still in the car and marlon's like what are you doing he goes we're on our way to your aunt's funeral i'm like i'm getting this painting I'm getting it he's like kara he goes we're on our way to can you not be respectful i said oh aunt sandy knows what i'm trying to do i said aunt sandy <laughs> will get me this painting i said she she's on her pink cloud right now going go kara get that painting so i did <laughs> love it love it just a little competitive yeah i know and what's funny is 
I'm hoping everyone in the chat knows this. Um, for these events, it is not a competition. We don't give out gold medals, silver medals, third place. It's not a first, second, third place. But I think some people, and they might be new or this is their first event, think it might be a competition. And I'm thinking, I would hate for it to be a competition because these events are, you know, so many people are participating and everything else I'd hate for it to be, you know, but some people think it, it's a competition and they're going to win a prize for the best painting. And I'm like, no, 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 no. You just, you, you enjoy your painting and it is a gold medal painting no matter what it is. So that's right. And I'll tell you guys, I love the painting so much. It takes me months to complete my painting and I'm okay with it. I mean, literally like three, four months to complete one painting. I probably finish about four paintings in a year because I love them so much and I hate when they're over. I take my time. I'll step back and just look at a painting for 30 minutes. Yeah. And enjoy it. So no rush for me. Do you, you listen to my book? pictures? I, you can see my progress, but I don't rush. It takes me some time, but I love it. Do any of you guys listen to books when you diamond paint? Yes, you do. Okay, so when I like paint, paint, I listen to books, and if I go back and look at the painting, I get like the feeling from the book, oh, like when wow. I look at it. So I don't know if you guys do you get that with your diamond paintings then too? I do that with music. I do. Yeah, I listen to music when I diamond paint, and when I hear the song. I see the music and when I look at the painting, I remember the music that I was listening to. Right? Yeah. When I hear the song, I see the painting. Mm -hmm. And when I look at the painting, I hear the music. It's pretty cool. Yeah. I also yeah. listen to the same songs over and over again. So. Me too. <laughs> you too. I'm one of those people. I'm stuck in the early 2000s. I, I can't break away from it. <laughs> yeah, 80s and 90s. Yep. Um, Alyssa got me started on A Court of Thorns and Roses. So. Yeah. Um, and I kept calling her go when I there it was so funny because there was a time period where I don't know what was going on, but I wasn't listening. And Alyssa would call and go, Are you any further in a court of thorns and roses? I'm like, No, she's still in the dungeon. I left her in the dungeon. I gotta get her out of the dungeon. I'm sorry. Gary, you gotta listen to Assassin's Blade too. I think there's like eight books of that one. It is so good. It's so good. I love front of glass. Yes. The one, okay, I just got one. Um, it's called, uh, it's it's the Grimm series. Amy Boyle's Grimm. I haven't seen that one. Uh, it's called, it's uh, the Withering Mysteries. And he's, uh, he's a, it's a fantasy. He's a monster hunter and all kinds of stuff. But anyway, um, but it's comical. So, you know, it's not, it, it kind of gets dark at times, but it's funny too, because he gets into all these funny situations with monsters where he's just like, really? I, I cannot believe this is happening. You're an idiot, you know, whatever, but it, it, he's funny. That's cool. Oh, okay. So before we go, because uh, gosh, this time has just flown. Oh, that went by really fast. <laughs> final guys, final reminders. Um, Rochelle has put up two different threads one is the start and one is the week one progress for whatever category so two different threads three different categories for whatever you're working on so make sure that you post your start in the start thread it's all labeled it looks very nice and the second one is your week one progress now you can wait this week until you make, if you just started, you can wait till you make some progress to show your week one progress. Again, the deadline is Saturday night, 10 o'clock central. The comments are gonna get shut off. So make sure that you post your week one progress by then. Sunday is a rest day. Remember, we're not doing anything with posting, what have you. The week two threads will go up early on Tuesday morning, excuse me, uh, uh, early on the next Monday morning. And again, the deadline will be the following Saturday, 10 o'clock. We're keeping the schedule the same running through the event. So make sure this week that you post your start and you post your week one progress. But before we go, Rochelle, I see my favorite painting. Well, I haven't seen all that you've done, but will you show us Saint? Saint? You guys have yes. to see this. You have to see this painting. It is unbelievable. She pulled it out at the retreat and I was like, oh. I'm yeah, so this is uh this is saint and i may have shown it before and what i'll do is i'll take a picture and put it out on the dakota thon website 
I'll move my camera closer. Let's see if you guys can see. It's gorgeous. So Saint was a lot of fun. Let me get it straightened out for you guys. Hold on. All right. She shimmers. All of my enhancements come from DP. Was oh, she's no Tina Bernie. Hold on. I'll get you guys. Hold on. Stay with me. <laughs> there we go. Here we go. So all, right. all of my enhancements come from DP with sparklers. And just really quickly, what I tried to do was just enhance. But for me, when I look at a painting, I just see different colors. I see different designs. And it's a horse. And I was thinking about the breed and the horse is here. So I got crowns and slivers and big bling, all types of sparklers from DP with sparklers. Up here, you'll have like some glow glass as well as some bubbles down in the water. It's just a fun painting. It really is. It's just a fun painting. I had a lot of fun doing it. It took me probably about four or five months, but I really love it. It's just a lot of fun. There's just so much you can do with Dakota's work. Mm -hmm. And this one here, uh, again, the metallic just kind of drew my attention to it. And another one of our sponsors, Crystal Canvas Art Designs, Amy Reed, she helped me with the framing. So she was able to help me work through getting a frame that really sets off the painting. And I don't want to have it hung, but for now, I just have it on this uh, stand behind me. But I absolutely love it. So when I walk into the lab, all right, this is the Bling Lab, I get a chance to, of course, um, you know, I, I love the calendar. So I see the calendar. I see my painting and behind this painting is a blue leather couch that I just sit back and just look at everything. And I love it. A lot of fun. Yay. Okay. So Rochelle, um, let me ask you really quick in your process, because I know um, you play a lot with, like I said, I replace, but Rochelle takes it to a whole nother level um, because colors are changed, all kinds of stuff. So do you think it takes you longer? I mean, do you ever put stuff down and then go, no, no, no. I don't like that. No, you nope. just, okay. No, nope. but I do study the picture. Okay. So I study it for quite a bit. I'll look at the picture and I'll have these colors in my head. I'll study it a bit. I'll take a picture of the picture and I'll put like a little outline of what I want to put where. Mm -hmm. And then I just let it go. I gotcha. just start. And let it go. But I absolutely love it. Like what I did for Snow Tiger. Maybe I'll put up on my YouTube. Because Snow Tiger, again, colors are in my head. I just pull them from my bling. I mm -hmm. put it in like a little carrier. Then I pull the painting out. And I say, oh, wait a minute. This might be a little off. I like this green. Or I like this pixie. Or I like this softness. Or I want it to look a little in your face. Like Libra, you have to wear sunglasses when you look at Libra. Literally. <laughs> Okay, I I totally missed something. Leopard Leatherworks, you are in trouble. They did a super chat. Oh my gosh, I am so sorry. I'm so remiss. My yes. attention span is that of a gnat. Thank you so much, Tim and Carrie. It says, let's kick off this great event to celebrate our love of Dakota's art. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much, Tim and Carrie. That is awesome. I always say when they super chat, I'm like, it's just going to go back to Leopard Leatherworks. So... <laughs> And I'll give everybody right. one tip just before we go, right? Yeah. There are colors that, for me, are my go-tos. And again, DP with sparklers. But heaven, throw heaven in any Dakota painting. You'll love it. Aww. Square crystal 3325. It looks like nothing, but when you put it down, it just sets off the blue, right? Square crystal 796AB. It's just a blue that you can just mix and, you know, have fun with it. It blends with all of Dakota's blues. And then I have this S for S light blue, another blue that just, you can't go wrong when you put it down because have it you blends worked, with all the colors. Have you worked with 792? I'm obsessed yes, with 792. <gasps> mm -hmm. I love that color yes. so much. Yes. So again, all the metallics, you can't go wrong. Um, I use a lot of the silver metallic. I use a lot of this S. S for S light blue, as well as the S for S champagne, heaven, awakening. They just all look, no matter what you do, no matter yeah. what you do, if you just mix it in, it just looks good. It really does. And pixie, you know, all the pixie blues. And see, yeah. I have a whole, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to go crazy. I know. But my level of bling just, I just pull <laughs> the colors that I think will look good. And then yeah. I just start picking from them. I don't use yeah. them all, but I just have them in front of me because it just depends on how I'm feeling. 
But blue is my thing. So cobalt, you know, you can't go wrong with cobalt. Yep. You know, 3607, you can't go wrong with 3607. <laughs> Three, just all the blues. Ocean, can't go oh wrong with God. ocean. So <laughs> trust me. DP with sparklers, it. if you go on, um, Tima has quite a bit of bling in all the colors that really set off the paint. And don't, listen, my whole thing is don't be scared because you can go for enhancement suggestions, right? You don't have to buy everything. You might just pick a few things from the suggestions that Tima puts out there, but you really can't go wrong. Play around, it's fun. Yeah, it really it is. is fun. And come check out my YouTube channel because you'll see yeah. how I bling. Yes. Oh, by the way, guys, if you can, um, I would really like for you to show some love to our committee. Please go subscribe to Bling It Up. Subscribe to the Diamond Painting Accountant. Subscribe to Dakota. Subscribe to Mysteria. That's Brandy. Um, please subscribe to all the hosts' uh, YouTube channels. It's a great way to support and um, show them love, and it's free. And um, I just want them recognized for for all of their work. So. Um, you know, again, thank you guys so, so much. And thank all of you for being here and our amazing sponsors. I'm excited. Um, and we will see you back here next week. And you have no idea what kind of shenanigans we're going to get into. So you got to come back next Monday. So it'll be fun. And um, I'm excited to see your progress on everything. I'll be checking out those threads. So thank you, Dakota, for being here. And right. listen, Rochelle, love thank you guys. You. All right. Thank you all. Bye. Bye. See you guys later. Bye.